Hey, what's up, you guys? Welcome back to another session of... Um, I almost said Minecraft Leavers as well. <laughs> That's a different series, and I don't know how to record on the Xbox One yet, so that can be figured out later on. But here I am, and we are back. <clears throat> Let's get some shit done. I did get a lot more stuff done off camera. It doesn't look different, but the land is like a few blocks lower now. Uh, it's almost even complete with the farm. It's been so many shovels later. Like, so many shovels, because I've also been working on that little hill over there so i can start i can see my dock finally um yeah i'm gonna kind of cut it down so it's a little more smooth um and in this area too because i like to go that way so i'd like to go this and then that way but um there's a lot of like terrain that's messed up here because there's an aquifer here and that's what leads into there and then um over here where this little like cutout was it actually has like a little like cave tunnel so um yeah, it's a lot of fixing to do, and it's requiring a lot of iron for a lot of tools. Like, this shovel is not the shovel I had last week. Like, this is, like, <laughs> this is from, like, last night. Like, brand new. Um, here we have all the materials I gathered for building our little, like, fishing house dock thing on the water. So, we're going to go ahead and take that and do that now. Um, let's go ahead and clear out my inventory so I can at least take all this stuff. Um, let's see, let's get stuff out of the way. We don't need two stacks of cooked salmon. And then, we don't need two stacks of raw cod. Uh, yeah, I have so much fish, like, it's not just this. You gotta see my chest. So much fish, because I've been fishing off camera like crazy. I got more Nautilus shells, more bones. Um, I got another bow to repair this one a little bit more. Um, I got more books. And thank goodness I have a fortune too, but I also finally caught... Because I was like, that's not good enough. It's only a fortune 2, and it's also mixed with protection 3. So if I put it on the pickaxe, it's just going to, like, only do one of the enchantments. It's going to be really dumb. It's not going to fit it. Um, that's why I wish you could, like, divide a book into two. But I do have this chest over here. It is ready. It's ready to be enchanted with efficiency 3 and fortune 3. So it's going to be expensive, but I have 36 levels because I've been fishing for so long. So we're going to be fine. Don't worry. Um, we have everything here for building, I suppose. Um, I think we only need like half of this, maybe a quarter of this birch, <laughs> a third maybe, just because it's, it's a, that's going to equal several stacks of 64 wood. And then this isn't going to be turned into anything, it's going to be actual logs. This is the glass for the building. Um, and these are the bricks for some more decor. And then, I w where's my, there it is. This is for the glass. Um, this is for any more, no, yeah, no, yeah, no. Um, I was going to make more fishing rods, but I could just leave these special ones in the uh, little area. Um, okay. Yeah. Oh, and then I also found these off camera. I, so I was trying to find a jungle, and I went that way. I couldn't find anything. I went, basically, in my area, I went in a circle multiple times, going further and further out. And I found the treasure maps all over here. There's, like, ocean biomes over there where there's a lot of abandoned ships and stuff that were, like, crashed. And um, I found some of these uh, buried treasure maps. And I don't really know how to use it because, in this texture pack particularly, I don't know what's land and what's water. I think the land might be the orange, but I'm not sure. Kind of... If you look at it the other way around, it might actually also be the water. I don't know. It doesn't make sense to me. And I also don't know how to activate it because, like, I click like it's a normal map, but it doesn't do much. So um, if anyone can, like, comment and be helpful, <laughs> they figure stuff out for me. <laughs> um, yeah. And, yeah, we have all this potion ingredients. We're going to need to go into another soon. So I'm going to work on getting another ingredient as well once I get this enchanted. Um, and ready to go so that's what the that's the goal of today this morning um is enchanting this pickaxe getting those diamonds getting the nether portal ready um and then building this building entirely the building might be a little bit larger of a priority because it's going to take a little longer uh let's see what else can we add into this structure to make it a little more pretty uh not much huh lapis is for magic i might just leave that for magic um 
emeralds are for trading, but I like keeping them. I don't know. No more decorative blocks. Okay. Oh, and I did find that first diamond right there from a uh, chest in one of the little uh, sunken ships. Not from down there. But I did also, while exploring my whole entire area, over somewhere that way on the hill, in the swamp hills, um, there is a mine shaft that I found through a cave. Like, you walk into this cave, you look down, it's a ravine, and it automatically has a freaking mine shaft in there. So that's something to explore later on, too, so we can find more diamonds that are just loose in the chests. And also find a spawner, create a uh, trap for that, so we can, like, grind XP. Um... Yeah, let's get started. No more talking, just because I know how some people are. They're going to be like, the video starts at this point. <laughs> I know how that is. And it's frustrating, but I mean, lately I've been watching videos in 1.75 speed just to like still understand what's going on, but like just get it over with a little quicker and watch and see what happens. Just so I still understand and catch up with other people's series because I've been watching a lot of other, other YouTubers lately because I've gotten back into being a kid again, kind of, you know, relaxing and enjoying myself taking my time off to actually take my time off. Now these are interesting. I figured out from watching a video, you can collect those and use those to breed turtles. So I think it'd be amazing one day to bring like wildlife into this little lake. That way I can have, so it's not so barren and dead, you know? Cause I know I get it to swamp, but like, let's make it pretty, why not? Oh, and also the sound under there, I, um, I, on that dock, I heard so many sounds. I was like, where are these creatures at? I dug underneath, I already have something ready for that, but I dug underneath and there's another ravine underneath this freaking lake. It's amazing. Um, so that way we can stop floating. Let's see. Um, let's get out my materials. Don't need that right. Um, don't down. Don't down. Um, we can put this away. Just to make room for this stuff. Okay, so I want to build it right smack dab here in this bald spot of seagrass. Um, let's do... I don't know how big I want the structure to be yet, though. So I'm going to kind of... Yes. So, port the structure is going to be right here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. It's a ten by ten, isn't it? I need to recount. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. How did I fuck that up? <laughs> I, oh man, hold on. I am not counting. Two, three. Because I'm counting this block as well. So, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. That's eleven. Um, an odd number would equal single door for the building versus double doors. I want double doors, so let's mm, let's go out one more on this. There we go. And then we can mine this one down. Yeah. Um, so we'll do a 12 by 12. That's a pretty big like fishing area. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. I'm very particular when building in Minecraft. <laughs> I do measurements like this all the time, especially on my other world where I build skyscrapers all the time. Like, I count the hell out of those skyscrapers. I make sure I know the dimensions, the, the height, everything, before I even start, like, building an actual high-rise. It's almost engineer-like. <laughs> it's really weird. Um, I think the easiest way to do this would probably be uh, put up the support beams on each corner. Um, and then do the do the little, like wrap around porch that I want to do. So I think I want it off the water by two or three blocks. So that's two blocks. And then I'm going to put the building right on top of this. Um, and the way we can do it is I was thinking, give me birch logs. There we go. And we're going to go this and go across. There we go. All right. Oh no, I forgot to put the log. <laughs> no, I can't reach it. No. Ruby, please. Hold on, just go like this then. Can I reach it? 
Are you kidding me? Sure. Well, I can just jump back under the house, the, the little fishing dock house, and do it later. Um, no, I haven't decided yet. Am I just going to make, like, um, hmm, am I going to make that connect and make, like, a walkway that comes up to the building? Or should I just make, like, a ladder that goes up the side of the building and then you come in? That's a good question. I think I want to, hmm, I think I might do a walkway. I like that, because then I can put fence gates right there, so I, nothing can just get on the bridge, walk this way, and then come on up here. It's going to be completely safe up here. Um, that was the main purpose for building it as well, was that I don't like fishing on that dock, because I'm always paranoid. You, you see me when I do it, I always look around, even during the daytime, because I'm like, I bet there's a creeper somewhere coming from the swamp. Like, I don't trust that. <laughs> I'm just so untrustworthy of mobs. Oh, no. <laughs> Hold on. And this is a perfect opportunity to get back down here to go like this. Now, I really like this swamp area that I live by because there's not many opportunities for drowned around here, which is weird. You would think they would just spawn right here, but I guess not, which is cool to me. I don't have to deal with them. Oh, I almost fell off just now. <laughs> I forgot to shift. I, like, totally brain farted what button was to shift. I was like, hmm, which button was it again? Okay, oh, this is going to take more than I thought, which is good, because I'm over-prepared. If I run out of these logs, there's like 20 more to go. But I still got to build a little bridge thingy. Oh, it's over there now. <laughs> I'm going to lose my orientation like 20 times sitting on this thing, just because it's going to be symmetrical. You know how I am. I like building some of my structures symmetrical. Some of them, some of them, yeah, but some of them not. Um, more please. Thank you. All right, yeah. It looks kind of small now, now that I'm building it. Because it's, if it's a 12 by 12 in the perimeter, the inside of it's going to be an 11 by 11. Um, but the building might be a 10 by 10. Maybe, or an 8 by 8, depending on what this looks like as soon as I finish putting the flooring on. Oops. Sorry, a vast was being rude. It just keeps talking about like, hey, purchase a vast today, and I'm like, no, bitch, no. You're a good program for like antivirus, but like, no, I'm not paying the ridiculous amount of money you ask me for. Okay. Okay, perfect. Uh, we have the dock floor or the fishing dock floor so now i am going to let's put down a crafting table for this little dock Just smack dab in the middle because now we're going to make a fence post that's going to divide into four for each i'm going to need way more than this dang it dude so much. Might as well turn the rest of it into a stack. Why not? And then we can do seven and seven. Because 12 by 12 is going to be 24 plus the 11 in between. 10 in between, that's going to be. <laughs> Sorry, I'm really doing math in Minecraft. Because <laughs> um, you know how irritating it is to get that one leftover fence post, and you're like, where can I put this? I don't know. Just right there. I do need a lot, though, because I'm going to make some for the bridge as well. So, But for sure, we have 24 plus the 20, so that's 44. I'm really going to be that geeky right now. <laughs> I don't care. I don't care. I'm going to do it. Let's go. It goes by threes. I'm not going to get a 44. That's the thing. I'm going to get like a fucking 45, probably. No. Boogie. There's this. Yeah, see? Okay. Um, then we're going to build a perimeter. Let's start with fives on the corners. I want to see how wide I should make this. Because I can't. I, I think I can fish from over this, can't I? Yeah, no, it's going to do that the whole time. And I don't want to break this. So, 
I'm gonna leave like one space on the ends to just go um, kind of like the DreamWorks logo. <laughs> He's sitting on the moon being like, um, I'm gonna do that from there. So let's do five on each corner and then go in one every single time until we find out. And then the bridge is gonna be on this side going that way. So there we go. We could just build it straight out from here actually. It saved me wood instead of taking an L. I'd be taking it like a, a one line. So, yeah, okay. Because I like the original one being right there because that's the original dock. But the land is kind of about level with this. But I also got to think about the future. I'm going to flatten that. So, no. That side will be the side I'll do it on. Nighttime, no. Stop it. Um, let's leave about like a two wide gap. There we go. Mm. There we go. Because then the bridge will be too wide. Perfect. And let's light this up before something kills me. <laughs> Just because that'll happen. Come on. There we go. Wonderful. Um, that's lit up for that. Let's put that there. <laughs> I love it. I can do that. <laughs> that's really cool. Um, I can't wait till lanterns come out. I saw the new snapshot and all the cool stuff that's coming out in that. I can't wait for lanterns to come out so I can just hang it up on like little like street lights and make it all like middle ages, late 17th century. Like, you know, cool. Um, okay. Wonderful. Now for the actual structure itself. I wanted to build out of this. Um, so let's see, I think I only need two on each side. 